this clever stick over here <laughs> running over the fish while they're busting up yeah I'm happy for yakkers <laughs> if I can get them Yeah, I'm gonna stay here for the yakas. I can, can't keep slimies alive. <clears throat> oh, great, good job, Nick. He's on. I'm wide of him. I'm not sure how good this actually catches him. To me, he looks probably about, uh, I don't know, 20 or 30 meters away on the GoPro Mile Lock 100. <laughs> but he's on at the moment. And the best thing I can do is get out of the way. Ah? Getting sharked, mate. Oh, that'd be good. Where's your line, man? I'll get mine in if it's in the way. Yeah. <clears throat> I can't record. Yeah, it looks like it. I don't like uh... I was trying to get out your way and I was thinking, it's going straight to me. <laughs> Gone to the bottom. Grain earth, mate. <laughs> huh? Oh, it's coming up. Hell yeah. I'm hoping it is, man. Mate, if it's a cove, that'd be sick. I'm hoping it's a cove. Mate, it's telling you to New Zealand. I can't say it. No way. Bullshit. F off it is. Get it, son. <laughs> You wouldn't happen to have a gaff I could borrow? Sorry? Yeah man, thanks. I'll just wind in, eh? It looks like you might be getting help now. Hey, you guys going anyway? Get on them? Yeah, right. This is serious business. These young blokes in a tinny man, top young guys, gave up their fishing to go and help him out. Shout out to those blokes, eh? 
legends. I'll come in closer. The dance, eh? <laughs> Do you guys out here all the time or? Oh yeah? And, uh, Just from around here? Yeah, we're Oh yeah, that's not far, man. That's the hard part, man. It's always the hard part. I'll come around the back there and make it easier. Thanks, dude. Appreciate that. You're at Tanilba. Yeah. Um, you guys are just going to be fishing around here for a bit, are you? Yeah. If not, I'll, I'll bloody drop it off to you or whatever. I won't be too far. You, you mate, I can't, I can't take off with it, eh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, man, me too. Well, he reckons he saw it. So, nah, stay deep, man. It went straight to the bottom. Yeah, like, yeah. It's a little rod too, man. It's not as heavy as that one. Oh, I think that's a stick, dude. Yeah. I want him to take you in that way. <laughs> He's going the wrong way, mate. <laughs> as long as he doesn't tell us to the marine park, we're sweet, yeah? If we head this way, I'll be happy. Yeah, I've got everything in. I've Just... got I got one too. Oh, one. Awesome. So this bike here, they've been really good, eh? So. I'll see the tail. It'll look like a mile. Man, I can't wait to see it, eh? I can't really say it. It's going to be cool, whatever it is. It's got a bar on the but it's got a blue. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a, the only thing that's weird is it hasn't surfaced or anything. Yeah, it's after rocked it. Oh, right. It. Yeah. It hasn't jumped though. No, I meant like, that's what I meant, jump. Yeah, I know you saw the tail. Yeah, he was trolling, man, just around the rocks and shit, and just, he was riding near the rocks and went bang, and <laughs> I saw him hook up, I'm like, oh, he's onto something here, and then, then it woke up, and then, you know, next minute we're out here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we'll see how we go, man, it's just, I'm not... Yeah, it's not too bad at the moment. I could probably do with the exercise. <laughs> Man, it's good. Yeah. I, I don't. I've been using this more than my boat in the last couple of years, eh? Hey? Yeah. At the moment. Yeah. So a kayak, yeah, man. Yeah, so I get the fly, the fly, I, I worked at Heather Bray. I work at Heather Bray. Man, are you kidding me? <laughs> Ask him about Mick. <laughs> Mate, <laughs> you'll be <laughs> no way. I'm still employed up until recently. I still have my discount. All right. You're not far away. Come on. Here, Brimmy, Brimmy. Two meters. Jeez. Logistically, how are we going to do this? I'm going to have to try and get in with the gaff. I'm going to guess it's going to do it up there. Yeah. Sick. He's got, he's, he can say it. So Marlon confirmed, Richard? Confirmed Marlin? You've confirmed it's a Marlin, you've seen everything? Sick man, that's real good. You boys want the, the big gaff to... It's probably easier. 
if you guys, because you've got more control with the motor. I might. Yeah, we'll grab the gas. Yeah. I'm going to try and grab the fuel with the mask. Yeah. Yeah, he, he still thinks it's Marlin. He said it. He reckons that he is. Thanks, man. Yeah, he's got to be. Yeah, you've... <laughs> Holy dude, that's... That's nuts, eh? <laughs> All right, so our help... We're a bit worried about their fuel situation, so they've had to take off. Yeah, it's just us. Boat it. Huh? Boat. Yeah, we do need a boat. <laughs> Help's gone, and we're out here alone at this point. Not too worried. <clears throat> but this is a big fish, so this could go either way. Anyway, we'll see how we go. We're off Fingal now. We're sort of head right in the ocean now. Like, we've been in the ocean for a long time, but we're sort of no protection left. And Richard's been fighting this since Tomaree. So it's a, it's a good fish. All right. I'm rolling again. <laughs> I'm rolling again. New Zealand, here we come. I don't know if I can't help that because I've got a pedal. Yeah, man. Huh? I'm line, I'm yeah. That's it, go that way. That's the way to go. <laughs> Head straight back to Tomma. <laughs> yes. Oh Holy God. shit! Oh. I was rolling, bro. Did you get that? Oh, I got that. <laughs> we need a boat. I'm getting out the way, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh! What do you not think it was that big, did you? Yeah, that was sick, bro. What do you think it was that big? I thought no. it was that four or five foot. <laughs> oh! Do do? I don't know, man. They, that is the money shot right there. I was looking square at it. Hold on, I've got to see if I was rolling. I swear I was. I didn't think he was that big. I thought he would have been just like a four footer or something. Fuck, he's, he's solid, dude. We need a boat. Help! You need a Facebook? Huh? I don't know if I'll be able to get Facey out of here. Oh, yeah, we'll be able to. I, uh, I, I paddled over here to get another boat and I saw them drive off. So, kind of in a, not a nice situation. Another boat has gone to Richard. I saw the other boat take off of them, but now I can't see them because it's getting a bit up there to get up out here. So I've got to go save my bacon. I'm going to go up to these boats up here and just uh, ask them, seeing as they're a bit higher up in the water than what I am, if they can see Richard. Hey guys, it's Mick here. How you going? Here's my face. Um, yeah, the uh, video ended a little bit abruptly because I was running out of space and it was pretty windy so you couldn't hear what I was saying in the final part of that video. But essentially, I was uh, talking about how um, because our help sort of had to take off due to um, having not enough fuel, uh, I had to find another boat or attempt to find another boat uh, that could assist Richard with uh, landing the marlin. Um, but at the same time, I was taking a bit of water, so I figured I had to get over to Shark Island, um, empty the water out, and then, and then belt back in with the wind picking up at all. Um, but as soon as I saw a boat with Richard, I didn't really 
I, I knew he was going to be safe, so I um, I took my leave. Um, but that boat towed Richard back into the boat ramp, and I sent him a message saying I took on a little bit of water, just emptying my kayak, and then I'll punch it back to uh, to the ramp. And uh, he sent out the old search and rescue. He picked me up. <clears throat> um, he picked me up off Box Beach, so I was pretty much safe at that point. I could have surfed in if anything happened. Um, You're right. Hey. Yeah, okay. I <laughs> uh, could have surfed in at that point, but <clears throat> um, yeah, old mate said, just jump aboard, I'll save you the 40 minute paddle. <laughs> I said, you ripper, jumped in and the rest was history. Um, by the end of the video, he didn't actually land it. Um, some other guys, the other guys in the other boat got some footage for him, but they decided to break it off um, once it was uh, sort of essentially captured. Uh, because obviously, um, yeah, they weren't sort of geared up to, to get it back to the ramp safely and there's no point killing it if we, if you don't know what to do with it. So yeah, so Marlon lived to see another day. Richard got his fish um, and it was uh, some, you know, pretty exciting day all around. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. I'll uh, catch you next time. Fish because he'll try and snap it off, he'll try and snap the line off on the boat. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got that on camera. Good, good, size. good time for you and me to start a fishing fishing channel. <laughs> you know, that's yeah. a good, good size to eat. Yeah, well, I'm, I dare say we'll get some of it. I uh, know, it looks pretty specky. I'm getting it all on film. Did you, uh, want to a cat? What did you say? Cat. You don't. Oh, here's a tiny one. 